Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I wanted to show you my routine whenever I log into the game. And this routine is pretty easy and simple and uh, gives me some gold. First of all, I log into my uh, parked alts. I have this character parked in the New Kanyang uh, City jumping puzzle here. And this uh, jumping puzzle will always guarantee a J drone stone which is worth about 70 silver and sometimes it goes to one gold even uh, and other stuff like uh, rare gear which are really good right now because of the price of uh, ectoplasms this character is the uh, parked in tomb of the primeval kings in desert highland there's a couple of chests here we quickly loot the chests You get a lot of rare gear here from here. Just salvage stuff. Uh, this character is uh, in uh, the Crystal Oasis. Here. Thanked of, thanked them of uh, Nabka. There's three chests here. You can see the gear here. They're uh, like loot. So even when you don't want to log in and play, you can just log into these parked alts and just get some loot without even playing the game now we go to my main character i'm parked here because i'm waiting for the treasure mushrooms i have a video for that but first let's um, use the ley line, ley line energy matter converter you get that by finishing the heart of thorns story Sometimes it uh, have a lot of good things like yellow room bags. Take the trophy bag from there. Nice. We made, we made gold by just clicking buttons. I'm gonna kill the treasure mushroom now. This is one of the four rooms I do every day. I have a complete video for that if you wanna do it. But our next, our next destination is uh, Verdant Brink. But before that, I need to get the buff for uh, gathering from the guild. I always keep this buff the 20% uh, uh, chance of getting rare gear from gathering. But I was doing some uh, world versus world that's why I have the that's why I have the world versus world uh, war track. And one of the things I do daily on login is uh, go to each each of my guild. But you only have like three well two for me two attempts of doing this. <coughs> The two guilds need to be uh, different in level, like far away different. I have this twenty, like level twenty, uh, twenty nine, and this one is twenty sixty nine. Nice. So yeah, I can loot them both. But I actually used the guild hall to travel to. Uh, Heart of Thorns maps from Kantha without uh, wasting any gold. And uh, I wanna get back here. So there's a place here that have some... Uh, a line of muscles. That I usually loot.
now I go get my second uh, mushroom from here. Someone is already killing it. Nice. We gotta help this guy. Now we go to the third mushroom. Mushrooms are healthy. Uh, seriously, the mushrooms are really good. Like even with the, uh, even not getting the rare item that can be sold for three thousand gold, you get rare gear and uh, spirit shards, which can be turned into gold. That's why I do them, not just for the rare item. Well, I got lucky uh, with the rare item uh, four months ago. And here we have some more muscles. Muscle. I have no idea how to pronounce them to just say muscle. When we finish our dailies, we have to. They're easy. <clears throat> Jungle plants here. Okay. Come here. More jungle plants. Now we farm all the plants that are here. It starts from here. This is why we farm plants, guys. Okay, you saw uh, we got this from the muscles, but we also can get a more rare gear, a uh, rare item. And uh, we get the Maguma lilies. See? Jungle plants and mussels. Always loot that when you find them. Here we wait for the third treasure mushroom. And by looting the um, by looting the plants and lumber, we also get in volatile magic, which can be turned into gold later. And how much I have right now? Now we go to Dragon stand map. We need to loot <clears throat> uh, 60 Dragonite or this one that can be sold for about one, one, eight, 180 silver. One gold and 80 silver. I probably needed to calculate how much I get from. Uh, these few minutes but they vary if you're lucky for example sometimes I get like three uh, 
rare items from the muscles. Sometimes I get none. So that's it, we got uh, 60, I had 60 uh, already. Now I'm gonna need a... Uh, Kanth and Vista. To finish my uh, daily. Uh, I still have some uh, minutes left before the server reset. I'm gonna go to Lion's Arch. Doesn't have to be Lion's Art, but I need some crafting stations. I need to craft uh, the daily ascended mats. The ectoplasm refining. These are actually so good. I'm sitting on a lot of them, so I probably have a lot of gold. Just hidden. See these? So if I uh, wanted to turn them into gold, I can craft uh, these. Like their up upgrade. For example, let's craft aid. Well, that's how much I made from just 8. So yeah, it's really good to craft the daily uh, ascended uh, mats. So that's it guys, that's my uh, daily routine of making lazy gold if I don't want to play the game. Uh, I have a couple more things, but uh, I guess let's leave it at this. If you have any more questions, let me know. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.